as you said, you're worth it enough to speak up or walk away. Yeah. Right. I'm like, well, it's not that thick to me because you still want to have goodness and connection and well-being. And if that's not happening, then perhaps you choose new family as it relates to who you circle with. Yeah. And I know that's not easy, but. It's not, it's not easy. Mm -hmm. um, and I would also say it's important. Mm -hmm. And even if, even if someone recognizes that's what they need, if they can't do it, I think recognizing is probably, it's at least 50% of getting through it. Mm -hmm. And then maybe, maybe six months down the road, they can begin to consider having a conversation or consider separating or dividing out, right? Mm -hmm. um, and then a year later, maybe they're ready to, maybe with some support from other people, they're ready to individuate and ready to divide out, whatever, whatever that process is. Mm -hmm. Um, um, yeah, I, there, there are just so many situations where, yeah, so many situations where people are dealing with different things and, and I really do get and understand that we want it to be hot cocoa and cookies. Like I, can't, <laughs> I, I get it. Yeah. I, I, I get it, you know, and the reality is it's not for a lot of people, you know, it's just not. And so um, let's have, for those of us who are in healthy situations and are doing the holidays as well as we can and getting through them, um, let's have compassion for those who, who can't and who are really struggling because it's, this, this time we, where we are, I want to use the term forced, but we're kind of forced to be with, like, we're forced to be with family. I mean, I've, I've had conversations with people where they're like, well, I got to be with my family. I'm like, do you really, you know, do, is that, is it, do you really need to, or are you doing it because you haven't found another way or you haven't had another invite or, 